My art has improved since then. It doesn't seem like you've improved too much. This is very weak proportionally. But anyway, the point is, I changed. And not for the better. What's up, guys? A while back, we made a video talking about Colleen, whether or not she's somebody you can trust. I don't draw ugly people because their proportions are all over the place. Boy, oh, I tried to keep it cordial and keep it nice, but oh, guess what happened? Listen here, Sam, those parts. You think you can voice me and get away with it? No freaking way. This means war, Sam. This means war. Sam does what? Today is the day that Colleen gets ended. I'm eating Sam Yang noodles, by the way, which sounds weird given Sam's real name is Sam Yang. Who the heck names their child after a noodle? But first of all, Sam Yang noodles slaps. Second of all, I chose my own name. I told my parents what my name is. And that was all before I became a conscious human being. That was when I was a child and I had no idea what I was getting myself into. But yeah. Uh, you, on the other hand, you decided it would be a, a great idea to rip off a tropical fruit punch uh, children's drink. Colleen, you're like Kool-Aid, but minus the cool. You're just aid. But it's a metaphor. Because I'm going to eat you up, Sam. I'm going to eat you up. Don't threaten me with a good time now, Colleen. <laughs> We're going to keep this family friendly. I don't draw ugly people because they're... Look at that. She was so lost in the beauty of my face that she didn't even realize the frame was covering her face. If drawing is something that makes you happy, pursue it because it makes you happy. Because That's you the truth. Okay, Sam, here is my first question. What if getting likes makes me happy? Hmm? You know what? That's a good point, but uh, nonetheless, pathetic. Never draw ugly people, especially not yourself. She just calls you ugly, but no, you're not. There's beauty deep down inside, somewhere hidden in there. It's, it's, I, I believe. <laughs> Have you seen his Instagram? All of them are yassified girls, not a single ugly person. Oh wait, here it is. Oh, oh. Interest <laughs> is your best pal. Cut off. Look at that. Look at how he reacted to Cloud when he saw his art in my video. You know, Sam, we're not as different as you think we are. We're not as different as I think we... That is the classic villain line. That was a horrible, horrible thing. Can we... Hold on. This what why the gap? Why the gap? I mean, it seems to me like you're having trouble lining up these two clips just like how you have trouble lining up your own thoughts when it comes to giving art advice. Somebody in the comments said that Sam does farts sounds like your OnlyFans account. Sam, be honest with us. Do you have an OnlyFans or not? I uh I can explain. You really do a thing about color theory? No, you don't. Sam, you did me dirty. That was a good one. You set yourself up for that one. You walked right into it. I simply seized the opportunity. You of all people should know a thing or two about seizing opportunities as a clout chaser. That video was two years ago. I'm telling you guys, my art has improved since then, okay? Yeah, has it really? From what I can see, doesn't seem like you've improved too much. This is very weak proportionally. I mean, have you seen my recent art? Literally so good. <laughs> Bro, why would I get paid for saying- uh, What are you talking into? To be fair, he is practicing what he preaches. On one hand, he draws what makes him happy, aka hot girls. But on another hand, these drawings are like viral posts that you see on Instagram. You like it because it's aesthetic, yeah. But these viral posts on Instagram are viral for a reason. It can be relatable or it makes you feel some type of way, like those thirst trap posts. So he takes that feeling and puts it onto his art. So even with a simple art style, he still makes you want to sit. You know what? That was actually a really good breakdown of what I do. You, <laughs> you nailed it. Fantastic. I mean, it sure would be nice if you were also that insightful in your art advice. Somebody stop me. Oh my God, what a... Mm -hmm. Cooling. Just look at your face. You so desperately want to make me your enemy, yet you can't help but smile at my charm. Maybe we're not so different after all. Sam actually liked the seductive eye technique. Perhaps we're gonna get some thirst trap girls from Sam next. Liked is a strong word, and she kind of predicted that. Queen is a pretty cool person, and she definitely is. Oh yeah, I'm a real good influencer. No, she's not. She is a plague spreading through the art community, and she's a danger to our children. We need to remove her. She's like a tumor. But you really 
did me dirty, okay? This was an old 2020 video. Sam, you're not but, playing fair. I look but, ugly here. To the people... <laughs> look, I hate to be the one to break it to you, but... <laughs> you look exactly the same. But anyway, the point is, I changed. And not for the better. This is what I'm gonna do, Sam. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go through your oldest... Hey guys, so for this video... <laughs> Oh my god. Wait, hold on. I want to hear this again. This video, I'm going to be doing a voiceover to explain my main process and how I get from sir to finish. <laughs> so bad, you guys. I'm going to link that video down in the description if you guys want to see it. It's so bad. Well, you really sounded happy here. <laughs> and then as time passed by more and more, he just started sounding depressed. He just left me for real. Sounding depressed? I am depressed. I'm just kidding, guys. We're not supposed to joke about that. I'm, I'm a happy, I'm a happy, happy deep down inside. <laughs> okay, Sam, those parts. You call my coloring ugly? You call my old art ugly? You called me ugly. Play that clip back. Not a single ugly person. Oh, wait, here it is. Come on now. Not ugly. A medium ugly. I know my worth. The coloring there is too good. Honestly, I can't roast it. But you want to know what this reminds me of. You want to know, Sam? It reminds me of that one titan eating Aaron's mom in the first episode of Attack of Titan. Yeah, and you know what that reminds me of? Of how you're gonna eat me up. This ain't you. Wrong, wrong. How many times am I gonna have to come back and teach you kids how to do this stuff? Cool one. Whatever your name is. Are you done? Are you done feeding these kids lies? Look, am I gonna have to draw over? I'm gonna have to fix your fixed art. Boom, that's all you gotta do. One big iconic shape. You cut in and cut out. That was just a kind of a thing that made me angry. So uh, on with the video. To be fair, the hand I drew kind of sucked. Coolie! Stop putting yourself down. But fun fact, guys, me and Ethan did not coordinate that at all. Like, that was just completely coincidental that we released our videos about Kool-Aid on the same day at the same time. I suppose that's what you get for spreading like a plague tumor in the art community. That video honestly wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. Like I was ready to have my ego completely destroyed, but I hope you guys are satisfied with my rebuttal to uh, Kool-Aid. Anyways, hope you guys are entertained by this video and by the beef between me and Kool-Aid. Looks like I won, so we can just end it after this video, yeah? And feel free to subscribe to my channel if you want to see other content that isn't Kool-Aid. With that being said, I'll see you guys on the next video. Oh boy. This is really not very good. No, sir. No, sir. Not very good at all. Mm -mm. Kool Aid. I mean, Kool Aid. Come on. At least my noodle brand slaps. This just tastes like preservatives. Anyways, guys, there you go. For all those of you who have been asking for a follow up, there it is. And meet my son. This is my son. This is this is Peter. His name is Peter. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. All right, Peter. Let's go.